dear students yesterday we have discussed about memory fragmentation today we will discuss about how to resolve these problems so our topic is compaction as we know that we have fragmentation when the memory is allocated these are of two types number one is internal fragmentation and number two is external fragmentation now these are problems with the memory allocation so in internal fragmentation fixed size partitioning is done and in external fragmentation variable size partitioning is done so compaction is a technique by which external fragmentation is reduced we can also so say that compaction is a process in which the free space is collected in a large memory chunk to make some space available for processes together now it is a technique used in variable size partitioning when the memory blocks allocated is of variable types now our next point is with the help of this process with the help of this technique we can store bigger processes in the memory the free partition are merged which can now now be allocated according to the need of new process and this is also known as defragmentation now let us discuss the whole process of compaction with the help of diagram suppose we have a memory area now in this memory area
we have process P1 which occupied 65 MB and this area is free that is of 5 MB again process P3 is there process P6 is there and here sum about 3 MB area is free and process P1 is 108 MB now what is compaction we have the operating system arrange this free blocks all together so that a process can accommodate this area so let us see what the operating system will do now operating system compact this area of 5 MB and 3 MB as a single block of memory so this is partition 1 of 5 MB this is partition 2 of 3 MB and here the all of the processes are running so this memory block is allocated to a process which has a requirement of 8 MB so this is compaction now what are its advantages point number one it solved the problem of external fragmentation external fragmentation it is always gives a dynamic behavior it means it is done at an execution time now now the disadvantages are the efficiency of the system is dis uh, decreased in case of compaction due to the fact that the all free spaces have to be accumulated to a single place on a single place point number two huge amount of time is invested for this procedure because all the free memory blocks are transferred to a single place of memory third it is always done in relocation register it means it is always done in a dynamic environment at an execution time thank you very much